You know, these days, if you don't know something, you can just go looking for answers online. But does that hold true for financial advice? Well, now new digital platforms can manage your portfolio and charge less than a human financial advisor. Jennifer Krause tells us what Consumer Reports found when it looked at making the switch. When Allison Cohen began investing, she opened an account with a robo-advisor, a relatively new breed of online financial advisors that use computer algorithms based on your risk tolerance and timeline to recommend investments for you for a fraction of the cost of a human advisor. It didn't feel old or stodgy or conservative. It felt really um, like on the cutting edge of sort of the future of investing. Cohen is not alone. Consumer Reports says robo-advisors have become big business. Robo-advisors manage an estimated $53 billion, and that number is expected to grow to between $5 and $7 trillion in the next 10 years. Some of the players include companies like Wealthfront and Betterment. Asset management giant Schwab is also getting into the game. But experts at Consumer Reports say going robo requires a fair amount of faith in the technology, especially in a rocky market. There's no real track record. Robo services haven't been around that long and haven't been tested in a true bear market. Plus, robos don't account for the human element of advising. A robo advisor cannot help you prioritize several financial goals, should you pay down debt or save more. Nor can it help you navigate tricky financial situations like divorce or saving for college or handling the finances of an aging parent. Still, for someone like Allison Cohen, a robo advisor could be the way to go, particularly as a way to jump into the market. Jennifer Krause, News Channel 5. Deciding between a costlier human advisor and a cheaper computer solution depends on a variety of factors, including your financial circumstances, your reaction to risk, and your comfort level with recently developed technology. Consumer Reports has put together a quiz to help you figure out what kind of advisor might suit you best. You'll find it on our website, newschannel5.com.